like the way the GEA, the, the way volunteerism is stamped through the GEA is something that every other sport, I think, envies. Yeah. Because, you know, you just look at it and people uh, just, even, and especially in areas sometimes where they don't have a GEA tradition, they just say, this is what we have to do here. And so you actually get this level of volunteerism that 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 is that is exceptional. But if at the at the at the top of the pyramid, if you like, which probably isn't even the right term when you talk about the GA, if if you're like paying managers or if you're doing that kind of thing, that that jeopardizes all of that. If you know, even at a club level, if there's a manager getting you know coming in and doing you know mm, setting yeah. down dogmas and saying, right, I've got I've got two years here to uh, to um, to make, make, my, my make my mark, um, yeah. it's uh, you know so for some reason Gary O'Neill popped into my head there when he gave his interview last week about the uh, latest penalty against against Wolves and his first thing was you know first reason he didn't he was angry about this was because this what this does to my my reputation as a manager and you know he is such an obvious manager who's clearly thinking in terms of you know again as a professional manager mm. uh, in terms of of survival and. And, and building his reputation, mm. um, you don't really want that in in in, in the G.